Peter Obi, the former governor of Anambra State, is not in my party. But look at the momentum he is speaking, says PDP member Mazua Magaji. The presidential candidate of the All Progressive Congress, Bola Ahmed Tunubu, went with an all Muslim Muslim ticket for the 2023 presidential election after picking Kasim Shatima as his vice president. Several controversies have followed it. Nigerians are not happy with his choice of vice president because Nigeria is not a Muslim country. Why picking a Muslim as your vice president, ignoring Christians in the country? So what Nigerians are saying here is that picking a Muslim Muslim, uh, picking a Muslim as his vice president have proved that there is an agenda in which this set of people want to accomplish in Nigeria and they are not comfortable with this. Even now we have a president who is a Muslim, we have a pastor who is a Christian as a vice president. Nigerians are not getting it easy. In the hands of Boko Haram, in the hands of Iswap and uh, bandits in the northern part of this country, though they are coming gradually to the south. You understand? So this is a very big threat to Nigerians and Christians in the country. So that is why Nigerians are saying Muslim Muslim ticket is not workable in a country like Nigeria. You understand? So the APC have made a very big mistake. This is what they call costly mistake because definitely this is going to hmm, push the APC candidates aside. Then the race will now remain the now remain the Atiku Abubakar for Atiku Abubakar, the PDP presidential uh, candidate and Labour Party, Mr. Peter Ubi. Uh, candidates and all that. So Nigerians are not comfortable with this. In, in fact, since two days now, Nigerians don't they talk, don't they talk, they don't talk tired. But to my own, my own opinion, hmm, all this talk, talk, talk here and there, you know, you know, you know, mean anything. APC is not the only political party right now who is contesting for the. Uh, the seat of presidency come 2023, we have other parties who they have Muslim Christian. They have Christian Muslim. So it's not left for Nigerians to decide where to go to. So there is no need, you know, talking too much because this is clear indications that APC have peacefully, honorably skimmed themselves out of the game. That is it unless they have plan B, which is rigging. But this, they will not find it easy this time around because Nigerians are ready for this election come 2023. Anyway, guys, let's get straight to the news and get the full details. Peter Obi is not in my party, but look at the momentum he's speaking, says PDP member Mazua Magaji. The presidential candidate of the All Progressive Congress, Bola Ahmed Tinubu, went with an all Muslim Muslim ticket for the 2023 presidential election after picking Kasim Shatima as his vice president. Several controversies have followed it. In reaction to that, while speaking with Chinese television, Mazua Magaji, a former APC presidential campaign cancer, and now a PDP member said, the choice before Nigerians are more than the APC, and come 2023, Nigerians should count themselves lucky, as it is a present very good quality of people who are on top of the stickings, as all the four major political parties candidates you, you could think of would do better than the current administration. Going on, the Magaji reviewed that Nigerians are yearning for change and Atiku Abubakar has plucked into that. 
but Peter will be plucked into that better. Why Quan Kwaiso is mining that in the north? And with all that is going on in APC, the momentum will change. After saying that Magaji was interrupted by the Chinese television journalist saying he's telling all this now because he has left the party. But in reply, Magaji continued in his words that I am talking about Peter Obi here. He is not in my party. But look at the momentum he is speaking, which is why he is saying that there, there is the choice before Nigerians, before APC today. And come 2023, people will be surprised, he said. Okay, exactly what Nigerians are saying. Well, from now till December, these people who feel that Nigeria belongs to them and they can, you know, toy Nigeria, press Nigeria anyhow they like, it will be a very big shock to them. Because it's not going to be business as usual. Today, everybody is talking about Mr. Peter Obi, the Labour Party candidate. Why, if I may ask? And the same Peter Obi, they says that he cannot win election because his party does not have structure and is only popular on social media. But people keep on talking about him. For you to know that Peter Obi is the man of the moment. That is the truth. Peter Obi is actually gathering. In fact, all Nigerians, unless those who are benefiting from PDP and APC parties are the ones clapping for those two ruling parties. If you are paying as Nigeria, as a Nigerian, if you look back and watch what is going on and think what is going to happen in future, if these people take over Nigeria again, nobody will tell you, say, go get a PVC and do the right thing. Because this, this fight is not going to end. If we do not do the need for, at least make we sleep close our two eyes. If we travel, we could get peace. So nobody they come out from bush, make you kidnap you or kill you either. Let's do the right thing. Because Nigerians are coming to understand that these two ruling parties have nothing to have offer. So guys, I'm dropping it here. Can you share your thoughts below the comment section? Please do not forget to hit the like button and subscribe if you have not. Thank you very much once again. May God bless you all. Bye for now.